What is up YouTube, this is David. Today I will be showing you how to install a Sega Genesis and Sega CD emulator on your PSP. To start off, you're going to want to download Pico Drive from a link in the description. And also you will need the games, which you can look for on your own, and the BIOSes. The BIOSes are to be able to play the Sega CD games. Normally I wouldn't link you guys to these, but they are kind of a pain to find so I just link this website in the description just download the ones you need uh, you can find them here by opening Pico Drive and the readme there you go that is um, just download the ones you need I for this tutorial I just got one of each so yeah Anyways, you're going to want to download all these files, or Pico Drive and the BIOSes, and then your games. Now, here I got a Sega Genesis game, two Sega Genesis games, and a Sega CD game because the file types are different. As you see, this is a Sega Genesis game, and this is a Sega CD game. Now, they should look something like this so you you gonna want to have all that so don't delete any of it anyways once you download everything connect your PSP and go into PSP game and open Pico Drive and copy Pico Drive into the game folder of your PSP This um this is something else. I won't be showing you how to do this because can't be bothered and I really don't know. There's something if you want to compress games or something for a Sega C D, you know, look into it on your own if you're interested in that, but if not, whatever. So anyways, go into Pico Drive and make a new folder and just call it whatever you want. I'll name mine games. And this is where you'll put all your games, of course. So go into games and drag all your games in here I'm not sure if they have to be extracted or not but you know might as well extract them in here and also put your Sega CD games so when you copy these you're going to want all the mp3 files as well as a large file which can be a Q, a .bin in my case it's an ISO so everything you don't have to copy this readme.html just copy all that into the same folder once it has finished copying over into your game folder you want to go ahead and back out into the pico drive folder and now you can get all your bioses and drag them into this folder okay inside the pico drive folder so here I have the European BIOS, a US BIOS, and a Japanese BIOS so we can play every Sega CD game from or from all regions at least. And there you go. And these are required, by the way, if you want to play Sega CD. Alright, so once you have everything, you can disconnect your PSP and we can head on to the, um, playing the games. So when you're at your PSP go over to game and then you can start up the Pico Drive emulator when the emulator loads up you should get a menu like this you can change your options configure controls so circle to load new game and here we have our games that we downloaded if you don't see this go it will probably be here just go to games or whatever you named your folder and there your game should be so, let's test these games out. Oh my god. Dang. Oh my god. I just got destroyed by this guy. Let's let's bring it back. All right, let's bring it around again. 
See if we can bring the pain this time. Probably not. Oh, just changed the render there by accident. Oh my god, no, no, no! Dang. So yeah, there's that game. By the way, bring um, press select inside a game to bring up this menu, and here you can select to load a new game. This time we're trying out DBZ. Yeah, I'm not into this game at all. So yeah, let's try out the Sonic CD. No! Oh my god. No! <sighs> yeah, I'm not gonna get any speed run, son. I'm not gonna be able to do anything fast. Okay, so that was the Pico Drive emulator for PSP. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos.